guys, your own girl Matilda. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today I'm doing something new and I am going to show you guys how to do a simple basic makeup for beginners. And if you are new to my YouTube channel, kindly like, subscribe and turn on the notification button. And if you're an existing subscriber, thank you for coming back and subscribe and share. Let's get to the video. I'm hanging on by a thread and all I'm clinging to is prayers and every breath is like a battle. I feel like I ain't covered. I'm going to get straight into the video and first things first, I need to show you my wig. This is the wig I'm going to wear for the whole transformation thingy. And you know, see the way it looks like it looks rough. So the first thing I'm going to use is this leave-in conditioner here and this wire silky thing. This is just for moisturizing the shop. Then water. So now that you guys have seen my basic look, let's just get straight into the makeup thing. Let's make up my face. Let's make my face up. So first thing I always use is my spoolie. I always make sure I use my spoolie to, you know, brush this thing out and bring out the shape or the arc or whatever. Try to bring it out and use it. Then normally you are supposed to use just this spoolie thing to arrange it, but I prefer to use this a little bit of this to make my eyebrow hair stay in one place so i just take a little bit and i apply it on my spoolie yeah then just use it to brush my eyebrow and make it stay in one place like i don't want my hair to be scattered and all over the place anyhow jerry so that's why i just use it to make it stay like that so you put it don't put too much over your eyebrow and remove all the hair but it's like it's matter that seems to do from there i am going to put my primer so this is my primer apply it to my finger because well this is now I'm going to put on my face. Let's go. The thing. Yeah. Huh. So next thing I do is to use my foundation. Hmm. Yes, and it is so I like to put it on my yeah. apply it with my this thing, this thing, this brush thing. So. Put foundation on my neck because my foundation is exactly the same color as my skin. That I'm done blending, that's when I always use my do my eyebrow that's when i always carve my eyebrow so my eyebrow is well arranged due to the um glue i used so normally i just always go straight into my eyebrow so this is just it though then you shade this place as we are shading don't go and shade from beginning here, so I don't go and look like I don't even know what you're going to look like. So just shade from this inner piece like this. Inner piece like this. Shade, 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 shade. Then keep on shading. But then as you're reaching the front, make it a little bit light. I just like to draw one by one stroke as if I'm doing my, um, as if I'm drawing another, as if I'm doing artificial hair, like my artificial hairline. So yeah, that's what I do. So I just draw one, one, small, small strokes, basically. And it's not going to look perfect, so whenever you're making, doing your, I use this back of the pencil too. I don't know, make it feel, look real, so as you can see. So, the reason why my hair is showing underneath here is because my eyebrow is not carved. For anybody whose eyebrow is carved, it's going to be definitely easy for you, I mean, and... But if it's not carved, don't worry. Anyhow, 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 we got that in. You just have done with the first one. Don't worry, use pencil that the amount is already round. Make sure the pencil is sharp, so you can do the other one. If not, it's not going to look nice. You are supposed to use a lighter color on this down piece, then a darker color on the upper part. I am going to use my Melanie concealer. Well, you will see it's concealer thingy. So I'm going to put on, I'm going to use this for my eyebrow. Lighter version of my face, it is a golden tan 10. Yeah, it's just a lighter version. I think two colors lighter or color lighter. Give me. It's lighter than my face. Yeah. Then you just put it on, put it on your 
on whatever brush you want to use to do your um, eyebrow. So that's what I'm going to do. Just give me two weeks. So you hold your this thing like this. Some people do like actually I think you're supposed to do like this. But then I feel that when you do it like this, you have a better you just better way, way more arranged than any other. So because I have hair and I've knocked out my eyebrow, I have to add a little bit more concealer on this arc area because if I don't the air will still be showing. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more and just do that. So basically my own concealer dries up quickly. So I all I always blend one out before I move to another one and I make use of this of this brush. Because if I use my you can use your sponge if you are very careful. But me, I prefer to use this one because I just feel safer. I feel like I'm on a safer level. If I just use it because if I go and use that one and the eyebrow comes, I'll just start crying. It will end in tears. Well, in the makeup process, this is this is literally like the this is literally like the hardest part and the part that takes so much time. So don't go and say that you don't have time. Not to do it unless you are very very good at it. For, but for a beginner, just take your time. It's a step by step, a step by step process. So yeah, yeah, yeah. a step by step process. So after you're done with the first one, move into the other one and just from your arc. I wanted to try and carve my eyebrow but if I go and carve it I'm going to look like something that you people don't understand or I should just go and take blade now I'm going to do a mistake I'm going to remove my entire hair and I'm going to be looking like I'm bald is it, is, do you, you people used to say eyebrow when you, when you don't have eyebrow you bald Yes, now your eyebrow bolt. I think. And now, anyways, if I go and take blade now, I go and put it on my face. That means I'm eyebrow less. Like I'm, I literally don't have eyebrow, and it's going to be very embarrassing if I come to this place now. Come, I want to teach you without eyebrow. I don't even have. As I want to do the thing, it's just going to be very funny. So you're going to take your me. I use my normal Mac foundation, the one I showed you in the very beginning, to do the upper part of my eyebrow because I prefer to use my skin color, but. You can decide to use a lighter version depending on you. But personally, I prefer. Oh my god. But personally, I prefer to use my own skin color. So just blend it in to the little way you can. Think little way you can. Little way you can. You can blend it in. Blend it. <laughs> so tell me, do you think I have talent in singing? What do you think? Do you think I can sing? Because I'm just showing you all my talents, all my singing talents. You can hear my voice, nothing. Free of charge. Something that you're supposed to. Ah, no, no, no. Free of charge music singing. I'm, I'm entertaining you with my, my voice. Sure, you could not see. So, as you can see, my face is all blended out. My number one eyebrow, eyebrow, bro. Is it eyebrow or eyebrow? People should tell me. Eyebrow is number one, eyebrow is number two. So if it's eyebrow, just put it inside the comment section, number one. If it's eyebrow, put it inside the comment section, number two. Because I'm actually quite confused on which one it is, to be very, 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 very honest. Oh, God. Sorry. Actually, I like my which one is it? my right eyebrow better than my left eyebrow, but that's how it's going to be because your eyebrow lines don't match each other. I think. What do you people think? Which one do you like better, my left brow or my <laughs> right brow? Because it's not looking like you resemble each other. It looks like if this one is one brow, this one you don't look like identical to me. It looks like twin that not identical. To me. Anyways, moving on. So I always prefer to go down to my under the eyes. Because my own now, my under eye is darker than my every other part of my face. So most of the time I always use my concealer, my Milani concealer. So I put it under my eyes first. I put it under my eyes. So I just put it under my eye. See it under your eye and here. Let 
me draw. Let me help you. Let me show you people my drawing skill. Um, so I'm going to draw myself. To draw. So I'm dedicating this. I'm dedicating this beautiful talent of mine. So I want to draw this. This is my love. Take my love. I give you my love. You can have my love. I dash you. Mm, you can have it. Have it 15 minutes. Have it. So yep. For my nose, I hardly control my nose because as you can see I have a very fat nose. So I just you just So you just put it there. So you blend it in. So I have two sponges. I use this one for my nose and I use this one for my under eye. No, actually, you can use any one of it, but I use I just prefer to pick. Then blend it in. Just keep on. So you guys can see that the under of my eye is way more inner than it was before. And this thing is just for it to shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> so blend it in very, 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 very well. And I should I blend it in very well? That's now. Because if you don't blend it in very well, it's going to look some kind of way. My love for you. I'm transferring it to you as I'm blending it. You guys should just take it. Take my love for you, baby. Take it, baby. I'd give you my love for you, baby. Take my love for you, baby. People should be giving me box. Um, I say box. People should be giving me something. Okay? So I like to use my hand for this one. Just yeah, then yeah. Well, that's perfect. Just use my hand to blend it. I always like to use my hand because I don't know. It just makes me feel like my nose is shining. I can see people can see me. <laughs> people should know my nose. Okay, well, I squeeze my nose. Just, you guys can see now. Yes, that's it. Why are you looking better? <laughs> I'm looking good. So, um, I will move straight into my eyeshadow. It was a book. But normally, I don't always do the old background thing because I do not have the eye shadow and um, primer so um, this is what I'm using for the background thing I don't know again. so I use my hand for it so first people should not mind this thing broke yesterday so first I'm going to use this one this color no, which one? No, I don't want to use that color again I want to use this color yeah I'm going to use it as the, the, the base yeah I want to use it as the base I'm going to use to base my eyes out, so I use my fingers because I actually don't have the brush, that's the only truth. I don't have the eyeshadow brush. But then I feel like it just blends it in better. So, just use that base here. Yeah. So that's what I use that. So if, if, I, if I have any light color, because I'm doing the natural, if you have any, I actually don't have the brush, that's the only truth. I don't have the eyeshadow brush. But then I feel like it just blends it in better. So, just use that base here. Yeah. So that's why I use that. So if you find, if you have any light color, because I'm doing the natural, if you have any light color, something that looks similar to this here, yeah. this one. Yeah, just use that base. Then I'm going to use. Um, I'm going to use this one. This is pink one. Yeah. I'm going to put it at the outer corner of my eye. Yeah, the outer corner of my eye. So you're just going to continue. Yes, which one am I going to use? This one. So just use that base. I wish I could speak. But I could speak Chinese and you're like, Yong, 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 Highbrow, Yong, Yong, Ying. And you're like, Ying, Highbrow, put the Ying color. And you're going to, Yong, let me put it like this. Yong, 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 this, which one? This. Then put it at the outer yolk of your eyes. Then just blend it in. <laughs> what? 
I'm just blending it in. Yeah, to give it a nice base. Basically. I wish I could speak another language, like Espanol or the Turkish people have language. Tokian language. Or um, Portuguese. I can speak a little bit of French, a little bit of French, not even, I even speak French. Le mademoiselle, le mari, le mecca. <laughs> I'm almost your yeah. I'm a language speaker. So, I'm like I did to the other places. I will. I um, think my this place, what is it called? Just take the yellow color and put it in. Actually, under my eye, I love, I absolutely love to put colors to apply it. My eyes going to blue after so then there's somebody has to kiss us. Oh my god. Oh my god, I think you just entered my eye. Oh my god. Um, I'm done. I'm done with the look. So I'm going to be speaking in British accent right now. So I don't really know how to do it, but then I'm going to move into the accent. Like just imagine me flying to another Africa. I've gone. So just swim. I'm not more in this Nigeria, which I'm already in the idiom. So, so basically, I'm going to this is my pro concealer. I mean sorry, pro concealer yeah, and I'm going to use this for my contour. I'm going to contour it. So I like to put it like I told you, I like to put it again for better effect and more. Pop shows. Pop. Oh, I think I'm taking British. Oh my god. So I like to put it for better effect and better pop shows. Yeah. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit of Milani concealer, the lighter color, on my on the eye. Yeah, not too much of it though. Just to you know balance it out a little bit. And I'm going to do that on my second eye again. Just for a little uh pop it. Yeah, and I'm going to do that, so it's like, I'm gonna be so good, and I'm like, oh my gosh, oh my god, I'm okay. So you're just gonna put it under your eye, make sure, make absolute sure you're not going to clean the one you put under. So, that's it, that's it. I'm just gonna do that. You take this, your pro concealer, you're gonna take your pro, okay, back to English. You're gonna take your bro, your, I said bro, <laughs> you're gonna take your pro concealer, and you're gonna conceal your cheekbone, yeah. So, I just go straight into it for my concealer thingy. And touch it. So, I need to find my cheekbone. So, normally, just keep on applying the hair. I don't know, I'm so hairy from this place. Like, I don't understand. So, that's it. Then, no, you're supposed to just try and make a three kind of. Kind of in. So like I don't think. So under this place, you do it. Then you put here too. So and where else? Your. Why do I keep forgetting I'm speaking in British accent? So your uh, this color is supposed to reach this part of your face to make it bright. I can keep making this part of your face bright. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm so. Uh, depending on your kind of head, the kind of head that you have, you're gonna. Why is this not coming out? You're gonna put. Uh, oh my god, I think I will put it. Oh my god. I always like to kind of like give my forehead a bit of damage. This is done. I am done. So you're gonna take. Oh, I forgot. I'm supposed to apply. Oh my god, why did you forget that? I'm supposed to apply it to the side of your nose. Yes, and. Yes. So as you're doing, you just bring it in. So I can look all natural. I'll be doing with the tape of the same brush. 
So I'm just going to, when you are blending, please, I am begging you of God, do not do the mistake of bringing it down. Don't. It's, it's like a bad choice. Just please dab on it. And if you are even going to do that, just try and let it blend with the upper part. But yeah, do not try to bring it down or make it look, or just try to make this dark. Blend it very well. Oh, I forgot the British accent. So you're gonna blend it very well and just blend it into your eye and vows. If, if this is not British, this is British. British are lost. I'm not even joking. So just blend that you need to do. Listen, you need to back. <laughs> Let me do your back for you. Wait, people will see that I am a bad European speaker. So in this EBD, in EBD, you just put this. So when you sorry, do that in blending. Oh my god, it just sounded as if I'm saying if you're blending and pepper or something. That's it. I'm I'm never doing that again. You push me over here. Never ever do rubber and you. Yeah, that goes over in my entire ministry. I'm blending your entire face, so you put this. I this thingy, it's a setting powder. You're gonna put it with the same brush, and because, yeah, because it was clean before, and I, because I washed my brushes, I, I'm able to use it for um, different things. But if your brush is dirty or is not clean enough, please. Please, oh, I'm begging you, don't use the same brush for for the same things. I beg. Just if your brush is clean, just do this. Everything will come off. Well, for me, I used to come off. Me going out like this. I just do your makeup and don't do anything. So sometimes I feel like I look finer. I just see. Like on God, I'm not even joking. Sometimes when I do my makeup, I just used to do me this zigzag to remove this thing from my face. Like sometimes, you know, and I'm like, why can't you just go out like this? I just, you know, look like a babe, you know. So I have a beautiful thing that I used to, I used to put this in my, on my eyebrow. I don't know why, but it's part of the process. I just used to put it. I used to work it. Just make it look a little bit. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Can you beat this? Much fun. <laughs> Oh my 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 Ah! So what I'm saying, if it's that me, you can go out like this. I might not I might not like looking I might not looking good. I'm mean, no, 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 just tell me, I might not looking right. And you know there's hmm, lashes and you know there's this video that is going online now that they are saying that um the way normal people fix lashes and the way psychopaths <laughs> fix lashes i am part of the i'm not part of the normal people crew. like literally i don't even know how to hey, well, i'm not part of the normal people crew at all 
Like, how do you want me to fix my lashes? I can't. I just can't. It's hard. How do you want me to do it? So I fixed my lashes. It took me a lot of time. Actually, not So I just need to brush this out. I like. I prefer. To, I love to brush it out first. and the one on your eyebrow just brush the excesses out so as you guys can see I'm looking like <laughs> so I need some love I need some touch I need some baby some baby yeah. what does my face say I'm a savage classic that's it what is my face not giving you this The final thing I want to do is make use of my powder. So you guys can see again. Mac, I, told, I think I didn't mention I'll be using a lot of Mac products. See, Mac, sorry, yes, yes, Mac, yes. Mac, yeah. And because I've already done most of my makeup, I'm just going to use it to blend everything out just a little. Bit. Come and get it. So, um, I am going to because I said I'm going to use the natural color. Um, transparent lip gloss. I, 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 I love it. So, my lips are looking natural. Yes, um, yes. It has broken a little bit on my But then that's what I use for my highlights, actually. Oh, I'll show you something. That's what I use for my highlights. So I'm just going to do this because I don't want it to be. So I always like this is the last thing. And I'm done. You guys can see that my. So that is how I'm going to make my face up. And you guys remember that I mentioned something about my wig. So um, I'm not going to lie. So I'm just going to show you the outcome. You hey guys, this is me transforming from basic to daddy. I'm done. So basically. This is me, all transformed from how I looked before to now. So I'm done for today. Kindly like, subscribe, turn on the notification button, and share. Thank you.